Okay, 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 okay. That is much better, boys and girls. Um, I do see um, the likes on the previous video. And let's turn this into a game. The more likes I have on the One Life Survival Challenge, the more risks I take. The less likes I get on the One Life Challenge, the less risks I take. Okay? That will be, that will be a fun... No, that will be a fun um, counter to what kind of risks I take. So, I've got six advanced lockpicks, which is good for if any drop lands close to us. We have two, three, six, eight screwdrivers. We've got ten screwdrivers. Okay, so I can use four screwdrivers for the police station. And I can just take out my bobby pins. If I don't want the lockers to prioritize the, um, the advanced lock pick, I can just put it on the ground. And then it will use the... Um, lock picks that I crafted automatically so yes let's just see have we missed a drop no we haven't I'm going to do something different in this episode I'm not going to cut anything um, I have joined the server late um, as usual but um, yeah let's just uh, let's just not cut this until the sun goes down um, and yes, the likes are compared to the risks that I take, but let's make it that you guys leave comments, okay? If you like me to cut less, or, so in the comments, just say cut less, or cut more, okay? In this episode, I'm not going to cut at all. Let's see how that works out. Okay, I don't know if I like these four lockers more, but in any case, I'll just show you guys how it works now. I'm going to take out these four bobby pins. Then I'm going to craft the bobby pins quickly. And then I can just press Alt-C to keep crafting them. Make it a little bit easier. And now what I can do is I can put down the advanced lockpick and then put these four lockpicks in my inventory and then it should prioritize the lockpicks, not the advanced lockpick on the ground. Yep. I'm right. Oh, that was, that was a lucky start. I know my gloves makes it more difficult, guys, but we're fine. I'll take my gloves off if I ever struggle. And two. Oh! <laughs> Come on. Give me a break. Really? Okay, 72 hours. Okay, and now? Are you counting in seconds? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so it's counting down in seconds. I don't know why the other why the other key card disappeared so quickly. Ah, uh, what <laughs> Oh no, oh no, I can't catch a break. Okay, A3 boys, A3 it is, you guys left the likes, and I don't have a choice. Goodness gracious, bro. Oh my word. <laughs> yes. Uh, medium thievery, okay, that isn't too bad. Um, uh, the... Okay, hopefully my wire cutting won't get me killed. Okay, okay. Five shotgun rounds. No, we're just going to use a bow for now. So have we searched everything? 
Oh my word, boys. Okay, just if this happens, just press Alt to correct it. Sometimes your character gets stuck looking somewhere. Then you can just press Alt um, to break the lock. Okay, so we clearly, okay, except for the fact that I'm going in very unprepared skill-wise, we definitely need to focus now on screwdrivers. Um, I don't think the bobby pins will be a major problem, but I do feel we're going to need to focus on screwdrivers. So I think that's what I'm going to focus on. Just, just bobby pins. I'm just going to loot places where I can find bobby pins. And then I'm going to loot places where I can find um, screwdrivers. Hopefully no one kills me. Um, there's two other people on the server. Hopefully they're just busy keeping themselves busy. Um, and opening the door from now on. That window has killed me before. So don't like repeating steps. And you get food here guys. But I have found a screwdriver here as well. I have found a screwdriver here as well. There we go. I missed you, man. I missed you. I really, really missed you. I thought you guys weren't going to play with me anymore. What does that remove when I put that on? That removes the glove, but it gives me protection on my on my arm. Okay, but it's going to help you with a lock picking in any case. Okay, so let's remove the glove. Let's remove the gloves. And let's focus quickly on... Getting screwdrivers. Bobby pins is an issue, especially when we enter a bunker. Uh, bobby pins won't be an issue at all. You get them in bunkers very easily because there's a heck of a lot of desks in bunkers. But screwdrivers are definitely going to be a problem. So, and of course, inventory space is a major problem. Maybe I can quickly go check up in the police station. Go up there quickly just to see... If what, what have we got? We've got a standard backpack. It's not the end of the world, but it's not the best option when we're going into a kill box. So I'll just quickly go upstairs on in the police station to see if we can if we can maybe find a better backpack. With the spawn rate is very, very the chances are very low. My food's great. I can just drink more. Got my two liter bottle. Which is great. So, I must say, when I drink out of a two-liter bottle and I and I stop me drinking after I've drank 500 mils, and I make four circles of 500 mils, that really, that really helps me a lot. Okay, so, what are you really doing? Vegetable oil. We're not going to cook right now, buddy. We are not going to cook right now. That is not our priority. Check taste. That is still cooked, so we can use that for food, which is fantastic. Our survivor is prepared. Take out your bow in case a player wants to play with you. There we go. We got... Oh, yeah. We got... Okay, okay. It's looking better now. And, of course, we need the wire cutters. Of course, we need the wire cutters. But we, yeah, I think we're going to need an orange screwdriver, boys. I think we're going to need an orange screwdriver. That is a big thing. Okay, 0.45. That's excellent. That's excellent. If I get a block, then I've got ammo for it. And if I get a 9 mil, shouldn't be too difficult to get the ammo either. Must say... Oh, man, man, it's like it's meant to be, boys, it's like it was meant to be, what do you guys think, you think this is fate, I mean, look at the screwdrivers that I'm getting on, you know, 0 0.5 loot, it's like insane, the amount of screwdrivers that I'm getting, it's like in, it's like in the game's telling me, the percentages are working in your favor. Go and kill yourself. <laughs> which um, which I think is a very, very high possibility. I think the possibility of us dying is extremely high. 
But let's do this, man. Let's do this. I mean, we've got the backpack. Got the backpack. Let's do some. Let's do some focus looting here quickly. Um, I know this durability probably doesn't have any effect, but I just like having high durability items. Okay. Let's do this, man. Let's do this. Let's do this. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, boys, it's on like Donkey Kong. It's on like Donkey Kong. I've never found so many screwdrivers in the One Life server in my life. Look at that. What the heck is happening? Okay, okay, okay. It's meant to be. It's meant to be. We're probably going to die. But for now, it feels like it's meant to be. We're probably going to die, but for now, it feels like it's meant to be. What do you want, boy? Go sit down for us, please. Thank you. Thank you very much for sitting down for us. Just want to see if there's anything of importance here. Doesn't really matter how how many puppets the game throws at me, except the close quarters, which is of course the kill box and the bunkers. That is where things are gonna go a pity shit shit very very quickly. Um, I can use a little extra, just a little extra bobby pins, just to feel a little bit better about the situation. We have got a sewing kit, eh? Yes, we've got a sewing kit. So, okay, we don't need thread. We don't need thread. We've got a sewing kit, so that's fine. Fine, 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 fine. Damn, now I'm a bit sad that I joined so late, but it's just going to be an hour that I have to wait, boys. Don't worry. Just gonna be an hour that I have to wait. Maybe we should do the kill box in this one episode, man. Um, when the sun goes down, just gonna make sure my character's nutrition is fine. And then I'm just going to go keep building my base on the survival evolved. And then when the hour's done, I'll come back. That's the great thing about having two servers. When, when it's nighttime on the one, hopefully it's not nighttime on the other one. And I mean, all my servers are three hours day, one hour night, you know, so for you to catch both servers in nighttime is quite difficult. Okay, 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 okay. This, this, this building is calling me. It's not the, really the best option. But it is calling me. Okay, why were you calling me? Why were you calling me? Oh, because you've got five of these small little tables, which usually helps, which usually helps. Don't call me for nothing, man. Box of nails, I'll sort that out later. Box of nails is definitely gonna help us in the future. Okay, so maybe he just called me for the box of nails. Man, this weather's beautiful. The weather, like even on Survival Evolved, most of the time people talk about the weather. You know, the weather is absolutely fantastic, boys. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be running through here and down here because there are car spawns here. So I'm just going to be running down the road, boys, to A3 because a car is a big, is a, a car or a bike is a very big deal for me. Okay, a car or a bike is a very, very big deal for me. And I'm not too heavy. Okay, I'm carrying three times the amount of weight that I am allowed to carry. But I've got meat. I can get um, water very easily. I'm going to run past a bunch of rivers. So I'm fine, man. I am absolutely fine. Okay. 
So, I'll keep the instant replay on. I mean, really, guys. You know, you guys can see that. I don't care if there's a hundred puppets in front of me. I can draw them one by one and kill them, okay? That's why, you know, I just made it a bit less because it that really doesn't matter if you put a million puppets in front of me. Um, I can r run around them or I can deal with them one by one. And uh, now the game is telling me, put your money where your mouth is. Like, this is three, four, or five puppets. Um, but it really doesn't matter to me. Really, really doesn't matter to me. And um, maybe that's a cool screenshot, I don't know. But yes, guys, I don't really, I don't really worry about attracting them. Lost one arrow there. Ay, goodness gracious, buddy. Okay. But yes, like I say, I don't, I, I don't care about attracting puppets anymore. And you can see, you clearly see distance as a, as an effect. But yeah, I can craft arrows again. So let's go, boys. Let's go. Like I say, doesn't really matter how many puppets I run into. I really don't care about puppets anymore. Okay, especially the fast ones. The fast ones die quicker than anything else. And if I want to... So I press V to get the further view to see my character nicer. Press V again to quickly um, load my bow and then I can... Then I can transition into first person a lot faster. Okay? So I think this episode is going to be epic. And, I, and a lot of you like long videos, so get ready for an epic long video, boys. <sighs> okay, boys, I'm just making my way down to A3. I'm going to be going around the city and then down this road. Uh, just checking the towns where I can on my way to A3, seeing if I find anything. In case you guys were thinking that the puppets are not still a lot. Um, <laughs> the puppets are still a lot. Okay, the puppets are still a lot. I think my stealth skill has a major effect on it. Yeah, uh, yeah, advanced stealth, boys. Advanced stealth, I literally just walked through them. That was nice, man. Holy poop, I need to lie down a lot. Goodness gracious, let's get some food. <laughs> this is going to be a long trip. Okay, boys, while I'm jogging myself to death here, this is taking a very, very long time. Um... Who's making a noise? Yeah, um... My, everything, everywhere you walk is very important, okay? As you can see, if I hold control, this might not give me a lot of nutritional value, but it is giving me minerals and vitamins. Which, which will be important down the line, okay? As you can see, uh, vitamin D is quite important. Now, not all mushrooms gives you a lot of vitamin D, but every, every little bit will help, okay? So pick up all the mushrooms that you get. And my stomach is a bit full because I drank fresh water. Okay, but yeah, um... Check everywhere you go. Check for mushrooms. There's various different mushrooms on the island. Okay, and just make sure... Just make sure you don't skip any mushrooms. Very, very important. And then while you're out here, you might as well just um, level up some skills. You know? While you're out here, don't let these guys... 
um, worry you too much, especially with the... Uh... Where did you go, buddy? Goodness gracious me. You flew quite far. Yeah, don't let these guys worry, especially with a bow. I mean, I've only got two strength. Okay, so a 20 pound bow is very, very useful. And every shot you give a puppet levels up your bow skill. It just prepares you better for down the line when you get a compound bow or something better. Okay, so just make sure you're using your skills. And chop them up now and then. You can always craft the arrows, but if you don't want to craft the arrows, you know. Just chop them up. I did use the toolbox that I had at a town. It had the workbench. So I just um, repaired the uh, the small axe. Because we're probably going to be using it quite a lot in the future. But in any case, aiming for probably this bridge. And then I'm just going to be going down this road. And resting a heck of a lot. <laughs> Aha! A bunker! We found a bunker, boys! Oh! That tree stopped me! Okay, okay, no. I'm gonna have to use the bow, yeah? I'm gonna have to use the bow, yeah? Just confuse them a bit. There we go. As you saw, things got quite spicy there um, without the bow. Okay, so when they get into close quarters, especially on the server, guys, especially on the server, if they hit you on the head, you can die with one shot. Okay, one shot. So be very, very vigilant. And that's why your bow skill is so important. Um, so that you can become faster and faster using your bow. And that you don't get into uncomfortable situations. But yeah. One. Two. Three. Four shots in the leg. A three. Goodness gracious. <laughs> if we had a vehicle, boys, it would have been a brilliant day. If we had a vehicle, it would have been a brilliant day. If we had a vehicle. But of course we don't have a vehicle. So. Just have to be happy with what we've got. That is a M1. That's a suppressor. I'm going to take that. Always do do in these places. Somebody shits inside these places all the time. Okay. Let me just see. Yeah, man, one isn't going to kill me. One isn't going to kill me. So I'll put that on the ground. Take out a bobby pin. Uh, I don't have a ton of bobby pins, but I will get it at the end of the day. Put that inside my inventory. And it hasn't got any lock. Great, Lathias. It didn't have any lock. You are a genius. You are a genius, my friend. Okay, let's just see what's up here. Always make sure we don't skip anything. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Serpent. So that's the peacemaker and that's the serpent. Let's see what the serpent looks like. Mm, looks a bit dull. I'm happy with the, with the magnum that I've got. I like the magnum. But like I say, don't skip any looting points. Okay, don't skip any looting points. Now let's get across this frigging river, man. Holy poop, guys. This is where stealth really, really helped me. These two wolves were walking right here in front of me. It look, almost looks like they merged together. But yeah, if it wasn't for the stealth... I would be in some serious trouble right now. Right there. Two. Two of them. Two of them will be a major issue for me. 
But yeah, just another example of how... Um, I'm going to run now. Just another example of how stealth helps you a heck of a lot. A heck of a lot. Especially in dangerous circumstances like this. Really, boys? <sighs> Ultimate Hardcore Server is back, boys. Ultimate Hardcore Server is back. Try and sort them out quickly. You don't want to get surrounded too early. Um, and they do turn around. They can surprise you. So try and not get too surprised. Of course your stealth helps. But you can still get yourself into a very uncomfortable situation. I'm a bit tired of chopping them up. So I'll just craft arrows again when I need to. But I mean, while they're here, they are good, um, good for my skill, for my archery skill. And don't get too close. Again, you don't want to attract them. Um, you don't want to attract them too much. You don't want to attract a bunch at the same time. That's not going to be good for your health. <clears throat> okay, boys. Um, I'm, I'm getting there slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. Uh, this is the big boy. Okay, this is the big boy. The Lysoperdon Gigantia. A fuff ball. Okay. It's going to give us quite a lot of food. Quite a lot of food. We do need some food. But yeah, it's going to fill up our stomach quite fast. And I still have got, I've still got the backup of the meat. Uh, but my protein, my fat is all right. So like, like I say, you know, these mushrooms, these mushrooms can help you heck of a lot. And you'll see now that it's, I'm not going to let my stomach go past 90%. You know, otherwise I'm going to get the negative effect of it. But you will see now that I can eat this mushroom, yeah, 25%. I can eat this mushroom four times. I can fill my stomach up four times with just that mushroom, okay? Like I say, everywhere you go, be on the lookout. There's towers, there's World War II bunkers, there's forests, there's mushrooms, there's logs with... Uh, fishing bait, fish bait in it, and oh my word, is that beautiful. Oh, and how much time has my key card like, Okay, okay. We're gonna get there, boys. We're gonna get there someday. Someday. We're gonna get there someday. You guys are gonna suffer with me. You better press that like button. You boys better press that like button. You know how far that is to jog? I'm only jogging at like 13 kilometers per hour, boys. And I tried sprinting. It just drains my stamina way too freaking fast. So yeah, not something I'm excited about. So yeah, we're going to enter a little, little town on the road. Little town, and when the reason why that okay, except for that you're pushing your body far, the reason your stamina says goes red when it says thirty percent. For me, it does does let you burn a little bit more calories, but the main thing is if you get into a dangerous situation with zero stamina, if you always like pushing your stamina to zero percent, that one time where you get into a dangerous situation that can cause your death. So that's the main reason for me. That's the main reason for me. Next time I eat the mushroom, I'm gonna eat a bunch of a bunch of time so that it can just can just filter through my system a lot faster. Um, I mean, the way that if you just if you eat all, it stays in your system for a very long time. But yeah, I'm not crazy about. Um, What? 
the fuck? This doesn't look like a spawn point, but this is not a good hiding spot either. Boys, boys, boys. Oh man, this is beautiful. Oh man, this is beautiful. What's up, darling? What's up, darling? Oh my word, this game is beautiful. Oh, I'm gonna die of the beauty. I'm gonna die from the beauty. Okay. Man, oh man, oh man. Can you believe it? In this little... I mean, that's not even a town, man. What have we got here? Has this thing got a lock on? No, it's got no battery power. Yeah, okay, there's a fuel station behind us. There's a fuel station behind us, so fuel isn't a problem. But a battery is. And of course, no, I didn't pick up any batteries. Damn it. And if somebody hit it here, then they definitely going to come back for it. But first come, first serve, buddy. First come, first serve. Whoa! Whoa, wait, 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 wait! Oh my word, where are you guys coming from? Did I miss Horde Knight or what? Goodness gracious, man, you are you silent assassins? Did someone send silent assassins to take me out? Okay, there's no one in here. We need batteries, we need batteries, we need batteries. Okay, there's a big town down there, but the yeah, I have to come back, but it's worth it for me. It's worth it for me to come back because the vehicle is going to save us a heck of a lot of time. And there's a little gas station over there. So as long as we don't damage the vehicle, it should be fine. Since we don't have a friend, we can't push start it. But we just need a battery. We need any kind of battery. And I must say, I think I did see those 9 volt batteries. And I didn't pick them up. I didn't pick them up. Stupido, stupido, stupido. Zuki, no, you're not, you're not very fresh. You're not very fresh, brother. What's inside here? Okay, boys, it's becoming nighttime again. I had to edit the Survival Evolved video. <clears throat> Which um, took a little bit longer than I thought. Just a teensy weensy little bit longer than what I thought. Hey, there's a water pump. But I don't need water. I need food. I don't need water. I need food and a battery. I need food and a battery. But I've never gotten to a water pump. Yeah, I see a lot of sledgehammers. Oh, no, interested in sledgehammers. I, s I, I don't think I've been to a water pump yeah, um, that has water in it. Oh, this one has water in it. Wait, 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 wait. Check. 95% full, boys. That's my first water pump that had water in it. Of course, my bottles are full. I've got no water problems. I've only got a little bit of food problems. But we've got 10 pieces of meat, so we don't need to worry about that. Luckily, we prepared ourselves. What's up, dude? And uh, something tells me we're not going to get batteries in here. I don't know. I've just got a sneaky suspicion. A house is not the place where you get batteries. It's the place where you get a Christmas suit. Damn it, boys! Uh. Who searched the Scarlet? I searched that car. I don't care if another guy's competing with me, boys. I'll kill him in the town. If I see someone in this town, I know we are competing for that car. 
And it's worth fighting for, boys. It's worth fighting for. Let's do this. I'm just checking quickly what's going to happen with me, boys. Uh, my I, I, I ate way too many grapes. Um, and my intestines filled up because most of them are water-based. So my intestines filled up to 100%. But I haven't shat myself. I haven't puked. Nothing. Normally you get in trouble when your intestines get to about a 70%. But I pushed my intestines now to 100%. I don't get any warning signals or anything. So that was close. I thought I was going to lose everything. Yeah, as you can see, the circles are the circles are is filling up my bladder because the grapes are mostly water. So yeah, I'm losing a lot of resources there, but yeah, the grapes are more water than food, really. So I'm gonna start eating meat soon, but ugh, it's not affecting my um, yeah. Not affecting my weight too much. If you want to gain dexterity, eat little by little, boys. The more you prepare for long trips like this. And overeat. Your dexterity is going to suffer, boys. Your dexterity is going to suffer. And yes, if you think you can't see anything. Don't feel alone. I can't even see that puppet. I don't even know where that puppet's coming from. Until he comes into the light. But without the light, I've got no idea where he is, boys. I've got no idea where he is. Okay, so there's a lot of lights there. We are entering a town now. And there's a wolf. Always nice hearing a wolf. I do look out for the red lights because I can't see anything. I do look out for red lights because puppets have um, lights at the back on the back of their head, which all them make sounds like that. I'm not really excited about fighting them right now. I'm just looking for a battery. I'm looking for a battery, so it's focused looting. It's not standard looting. It's focus looting. And now I'm going to start having to lie down in a bush. Because that helps me not get detected by puppets as well. Um, as you guys saw now, now two silent assassins attacked me. Don't know where they came from. But yes. Um, you really have to start using bushes now. And again... It's not good playing at night. If I run into a guy with night vision, I am as dead as a doornail. As dead as a doornail. But at least the PvP damage is 0.2 like you guys know. So he's going to have to hit me quite a few times to kill me. Come on. No, don't, don't, stre don't stress now. You had all the time in the world to collect batteries. You know that batteries are the main problem in a vehicle. But no, I don't even know what the hell I'm looking at. That's probably a double building for food. And you're walking underneath the light. That's a genius idea. Goodness gracious, it's scary at night. Oh my word. You, you know that batteries and fuel is the main problem with vehicles. You know batteries are always the problem with vehicles. But no, you didn't think you were going to find a vehicle, eh? You didn't think you were going to find a vehicle. And now, two 9-volt batteries isn't going to help you anymore. You need to find something big, my friend. You need to find something big. And no, don't even think about it. Don't even think about the boot camp. Boot camp is not a good idea. What is this? What is this? Is this a house? I think that's a house. Let's just lie down here. Yeah? Okay, guys. I'll let you know if I find something. Okay, I'm going to be very, very careful. If I hear something, I'm probably going to shit myself. 
and just shoot it with arrows. I'll be back now. Okay, guys, I think I've lost it. Um, I've searched every point of interest that I think could have a battery. Um, unfortunately, I don't know everything, so I did find car battery cables, but logically, car battery cables needs a battery to charge from. You know, but if I can charge with just that, with just those cables, it won't really make sense to me. I know it's jump start, but you have to jump start it from something. But if it can jump start on its own, fantastic. But I am going to, I'm going to loot the police station, boys, at night. Yes. My key card's running out of time. And I'm going to loot the police station at night. At least the stars have come out. It helps me a little bit to see better. Ammo. Isn't there a box here that we can search? I don't know. Everything I search, boys. Everything I search looks like that. And I like it. That's the survival part of the server. But oh my word, it's not easy. It's not easy, especially when you're looking for something. Like overall, I don't mind. But when I'm looking for that specific thing, I'm like, come on, baby. Give daddy a break. Give daddy a break. Uh. Come on, mate. Give me something. Something. Anything with a vault. Anything with a vault and I'll go now. I'll I'll sprint for that car right now. Anything with just a half a vault. Just a half a vault, man. Come on, give me a break. It was I thought I, I it was gonna be a good day. It, does that mean only only when it's daytime? Is, is that what I'm supposed to take out of this? That it's only a good day during the day? I can look at it like that. Not a very positive way to look at it. But I can look at it like that. I don't mind. No puppet here. No puppet here. Okay. <clears throat> Guys, I can't see anything. So, yes. If I can't see anything... You can't see anything. I want you to experience what scum is about. You're not going to experience what scum is about if you make everything easier for yourself. With your gamma settings and your contrast settings and blah, 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 blah. High loot. All that stuff. You need to experience the good stuff, man. What the hell is that? No, no, I don't want to rest. I don't want to rest. There's no time for resting here, buddy. Okay, I'm gonna have to go into the police station. I the church no 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 the church is not gonna give me anything that I need. The church is not gonna give me anything that I need. Uh, you can keep you can keep that arrow you can keep that arrow and you can shove it where the sh sun doesn't shine okay just between just between me and you buddy just between me and you okay i know there i know there's two doors if i can find the other door in the dark it will help me out. what the hell am i doing what the hell am i doing This is not where I see my end. I'm better than this. Anyone in here? I can't see anything, please. A hat. We won't find a battery in there, man. We won't find batteries in lockers either. What are you thinking? Where is this puppet? 
I don't know. I don't know where the puppet is. <sighs> Can there be a battery upstairs? I don't know. I've already got a hiking backpack. Okay, I'll be back, boys. Sorry about that. I'll be back. I'll be back. Okay, I'll suffer alone. Oh, shit. I'm not gonna say anything, guys. I'm not gonna say anything. <sighs> I am not gonna say anything. I don't know where that other puppet spawned. But I told you, just follow my advice. Don't do anything at night, especially on the One Life server. Oh my freaking word, boys. Okay. Now you guys know where that vehicle is. I don't know where I'm going to spawn tomorrow. That was disappointing, man. Yes, I knew. I mean, he even laid down. He even laid down. I could have just taken out the bow. I wanted to run and then when I saw I couldn't run because of the damage these puppets do, when I see, saw I couldn't run, I just hit a blank. But he was lying down. He was lying down. If, what, when, why, doesn't matter. We're dead. <laughs> if you enjoyed this episode, Please leave a like. You know, I try to make it exciting for you guys. Give me a like. I didn't die in the kill box, but trust me, I'll probably still die in the kill box very soon. We just have to get all our basic gear back, which is always fun. And this character's dead. Dead. The next character. will will annihilate this island the next build is gonna annihilate this island boys see you guys later for flip six